This is January 14, 2018. This is daily video blog number six. Uh, right now we are at $10,800. I have went down to $900 or $9,600 as the lowest point. Now I haven't hit this low in over two and a half weeks, so it's a little scary that uh, the choices I have made so far are going down. But majority of that is because I hold a significant amount in Ryblox, and I'm really waiting for Ryblox to hit Binance. So Ryblox right now has been plagued hard, and I'm still very bullish on this. I am expecting at least $38. Uh, the reason, and that's a 100% gain, but let me just go over some of the issues that it's been plaguing. Ryblox has been played really hard on the exchanges. So Ryblox is a peer-to-peer -peer currency, no smart contracts whatsoever. It's just pure peer-to-peer -peer currency. I can send you currency, you can send me currency back, and it works instantaneous, it's secure, it's on a ledger, uh, it's using the blockchain formula, however, their own unique form of the formula. And because they're using their own unique form of the formula, every wallet is doing some proof of work. And that takes CPU power, right? So these exchanges that are accepting Ryblox need a computer that does proof of work to do the transactions. Well, when you're sending millions of transactions, well, it's probably not millions, but you're, when you're sending a lot of transactions on these exchanges, I'm depositing, withdrawing, and that's happening multiple times a second. Well, that's a lot of transactions, and it's going to slow down the node. So if you have a computer, it needs to do proof of work before it sends and receives a transaction. It keeps doing that. It keeps doing that. Well, eventually, that single computer is going to get overloaded. To fix that problem, you need multiple nodes. You need just you need more than one. So BitRail's problem was to resolve it. To resolve BitRail's problem, they added a second node and they got their problem fixed. Um, KuCoin is not working right now as well. They can't do any withdrawals. Um, so there has been significant amount of problems with. Ryblox and the exchanges and I think that's what's causing this problem this price to dip down now This is also a 30% correction give or take uh, it went all the way up to what $34 maybe even more and now we're down to 22 so to hit that $34 mark It's gonna be pretty high. It's gonna take a lot to get back up to it But I still have faith and I'm still very bullish on this So once the exchange problems go away Everything's fixed. BNB rebrand. Boom. Moon time. This guy. It's already made so many corrections, and I think there's a pretty decent buy wall around twenty dollars. People have been collecting. It's been around the stage. It's been dropping a little bit, but you know, people believe in this technology, and it's been shilling hard on Reddit. It's still being shilling super hard, and it's dropping in price. So it's sort of counterintuitive, or you know. You expect something that's been showing to um, increase in price, not decrease, but that, again, because of the problems with exchanges and uh, their nodes not keeping up on the exchanges themselves, right? So that's going to conclude this video for now. Um, it's pretty late, um, but I did promise everybody that I will try to do my best to do a daily video, so here it is. Uh, please subscribe, thumbs up the video, and we'll call it a day. Thanks. Bye.